guys, welcome down to the Quest for the Open vlog this week and you join me in Ireland. I'm here in Tall Faris and I'm doing some filming with P2 Putter Grips. So I've been using P2 Putter Grips for about a year now and I've been invited over by Mr. P2 himself here and, uh, and we're around just having a quick nine holes before having a bite to eat and then we're going to do a full day of filming tomorrow. And the course here, I mean this is the, the backdrop. It's a reservoir of some sort. So it's like a reservoir. It looks incredible. And there's going to be a Euro Pro event here in August. And we'll fill you in with that in a bit. Nine holes over with, just been for a run as well. Had a slight tweak in my calf, which is a little bit annoying. Uh, it seems to be a, an issue with me at the moment, just picking up these little niggles. However, it doesn't affect my golf, and that's the main thing. Uh, we've got a full 18 match tomorrow with Ender and a couple of other guys as well, very good players who I'll introduce you to tomorrow. And really liking this place, I have to say, it's a lovely course. It's undergoing quite a lot of redevelopment from what I understand. Some new people have taken it over and it's at a cracking spot, it really is. I'm gonna go grab some food now, and I'll see you all in the morning. It's got halfway round in the match that we're playing this morning, and it is a blustery, beautiful day here, I have to say. Course looking in great nick, but it's playing, playing tough. Videos we go so well so far, it's gonna be a three part course vlog. Got myself, got a call. How are we doing, buddy, okay? And we've got Neil as well, who's my partner for today. I'm not gonna tell you any of the scores or the results, I don't wanna spoil it, and of course, and who's just playing some sublime golf today. Nice to be I'm letting my partner make the birdies. I'm just kind of there. I'm there for the pars. There for the pars, the solid pars. <laughs> Right guys, that is it on the way to the airport again. I just want to say a massive, massive thank you to P2 and the man himself, Ender, for giving us a well, drive to the airport as well, but also for getting us out here to Tulfaris and having just a fantastic time. The videos that were filmed today with uh, Colm and with Neil, they're going to be coming, I'm not sure. I want to take my time with the edit, so stay tuned for those. Very, very good match, 18 holes as well than an 18 hole vlog in quite some time. Heading back to the airport now, so it's literally a flying vis visit, but will be coming back in August for the Euro Pro event. So I'm gonna release more details about that, but it will give you guys a chance to come watch and to come do a bit of a meetup, because I know everyone who watches in Ireland, a lot of you guys have been asking to actually do a bit of a meetup, so that will happen. But again, bit massive thank you. And they really appreciate yeah, it, mate. Concentrate on the road, don't look at the camera, yeah, on, concentrate, lost, yeah. concentrate, <laughs> concentrate. And yeah, don't get lost. So my job now is to concentrate on the sat nav because <laughs> on the way here, I mean, we were may, have, talking. may have missed a couple of turnings. We it's talking. it's no big deal. Yeah. You know, it's not a biggie, it's fine. But I don't want to be late for the flight. So we will concentrate going back. I'm back in coaching. Um, it was quite a late trip actually last night from Ireland, the flight was delayed and yeah, it was, it was quite a late one. So I haven't managed to get a video uploaded for today, which is a bit annoying. But just about to film my Swing Quest video now. Some amazing lessons so far today, really, really exciting changes. Not done an unboxing for a while, I've got a few things through, let's have a little bit of a peek. The image is great through, and that's probably the right way to put it. What else we got? Oh. As well as those blue sunglasses, we have. And this got a pretty good write up um, recently. So, this is the cool shot, the Nikon, the rangefinder. And I did hear some really good stuff about this. What else does it got? Oh, hello. 
little switch bay pitch mark repair. Got like a bag for the rate. Is that a bag or a towel? An elf. <laughs> Nikon, Nikon. Thank you very much for sending me that through. I will give it a go and let you guys know how it performs, but it definitely got some good reviews. Limited edition by the looks of it. Pro V1Xs. Well, Tyler, thank you very much for sending these through. I will test these alongside. Number 70, this is number one ball in golf since 1949. That's what that number 70 is for. And I did actually want to kind of retest out the Pro VX after testing out the AVX and being pretty impressed with that video on that, full video on the AVX testing. That's dropping very soon. Back home watching the US Open, and boy, it's a bit of carnage. So it's Saturday night, and the course is just really starting to get very crispy and very spicy, uh, to use some terminology I heard. And it's getting really tough for him now. Wow. And I'm going to try and take some inspiration from it, although Stenson just hit a shot rolled all the way back up the green. Ouchie. Um, going into this week because it's the Manchester Open, and it is open qualifying on Monday, not this Monday, the following Monday. So there's one last quest for the Open vlog before the actual first round of the Open, the regional qualifying. I'm gonna be interested to see how I get on this week. I've got a couple of big decisions to make. So I've been just testing out a driver, a Mizuno driver, which is slightly shorter uh, than the M1 that I'm using. Do you wanna go out? Dog wants to go out. Hey, 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 hey. That's it, lie down, stay, stay. Stay, stay there. Good boy, good boy. It's there, you daft dog. Paw. Hey, there we go. Good boy, good boy, good boy, man. Good boy. Oh, he's such a good boy. So some things I didn't actually get to. In so some things I didn't include in the. Some stuff that I didn't include in the video last week, because I was with Glen Eagles, I didn't get a chance to. I uh, did some point lessons with Lee Sullivan out on the golf course. So I went to Form Me Ladies. Uh, you've already seen the 18 hole vlog of that, hopefully. If not, check it out on my channel. But I also did some putting lessons out there as well. And Lee has been such a great help for me. If you ever are in need of putting lessons, make sure you go check him out. He's based at Torex in Wigan. So also, I'm gonna redo the draw for the Masters giveaway. So Seaburster, who actually won the giveaway, he's not responding to any of my messages, so hopefully you're all right, buddy. But unfortunately, I'm gonna to have to redo the draw. So here we go. Okay, here we go. So we're gonna load up the comments from the original video, and there were absolutely thousands. We'll load them up now. So good luck to everyone. Um, well, only unfortunately one person can win it, uh, and Seaburster, Murph. So in total, we're up to, okay, so we've got 5,464 comments. Good luck, everybody. And the winner of the Masters Hall giveaway is Jared Brush. Jared Brush, congratulations. I will message you, you have won the Masters giveaway. Also a big decision to make going into this week with the Manchester Open and Open qualifying. I've been trialing a new driver, a Mizuno driver. Now it's the GT that I've been trying. So it's not the one with all the multiple uh, options. It's just very much the shaft sleeve, no adjustable weight or anything like that. And I've been testing it in conjunction with the AVX ball. Now, one thing which is incredibly apparent so far is that it comes off incredibly low spinning. So that combination of driver and ball, super low spinning. Now, if you've been following me for any amount of time, you'll know that that is something I've always struggled with to actually control spin on the driver. So I'm gonna be using that a little bit more uh, going into this week, testing it out, using it at the Manchester Open, seeing what my strokes gain is like compared to what I was doing with my M1, because my M1 wasn't bad, but I just need to test it to see. So guys, thank you so much for watching. Make sure you subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Follow me on the other social media platforms as well. I will be posting about when my tea time is for Open Qualifying and also the Manchester Open as well. So if you do want to come down and say hello, you're more than welcome to. It'd be fantastic to say hello. So guys, thanks so much for watching. I'll see you next time.